with Val here with Greg Merriweather. So the people who represent you at the Capitol soon could be getting a hefty raise. One state representative has filed a bill which would increase their salary from around $16,000 a year to $60,000. Now, his reasoning behind the proposal may surprise you. Our Lester Dewey is here to explain this one. Lester, uh, good evening. He's kind of trying to open it up to everybody. Yeah, guys, Representative Joe Marino, in, an independent from Gretna, is looking to give state lawmakers their first pay raise in more than 40 years. But one political analyst believes this proposal could trigger conversations about raising the minimum wage across Louisiana as well. You may be surprised at just how much the people who are elected to represent you in this building make per year. The salary for this job is just not competitive to anything you can do outside of being a legislator. And that's my concern. Many of you may be thinking, so what? Their first priority should be serving you. But State Rep Joe Marino is looking to boost the salaries of state reps and state senators from a little less than $17,000 to $64,600 after there's been no real changes since 1980. It's been a financial burden every year that I've been involved in the legislature. I don't want to exclude large numbers of people from even being, you know, taking this job or trying to get this job because the salary is just cost prohibitive. Marino is not seeking re-election, so this new change would not affect him. He says lawmakers already get no retirement benefits with the job and says the state has the budget for it and the increase could get more regular folks to run for office. We will end up with a legislature that will be primarily comprised of, of, of either retired people or, or independently wealthy people. And that eliminates a huge percentage of our of our citizens. Personally, I think they should look at raising the minimum wage before they look at raising their own pay. I feel like if they feel like they're entitled to have a raise, uh, everybody else should feel entitled to have a raise as well. But since 2016, Governor John Bell Edwards has proposed an increase to the $7.25 minimum wage in Louisiana with no success. Here's political analyst. Jim Inkster. I would think that the governor might say, look, we'll meet in the middle 30, 40,000 a year, but right now minimum wage in Louisiana pays $15,080 a year. That's less than lawmakers make, and that's for a 40 hour week, a full time job. While some think Marino's views are reasonable about finding a more diverse field of candidates to run, they're still skeptical. I don't think it would pan out that way that it would be the common folk kind of getting up there. It is long overdue for lawmakers to get a raise. The question is how much, and the question is whether it's palatable in an election year because those who vote for it will be held accountable. So I'm told the raises would not start until next year. If this passes, it still probably will be really examined in the committee. The regular session begins in less than three weeks, guys. All, All right. right. Lester, thank you. <laughs>